Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to buy the Revolve Games token using Trust Wallet and PancakeSwap. I'm going to be showing you guys step by step everything you have to do in order to buy this token. But before we get started here, I just want to remind everyone that I do have daily cryptocurrency content on my channel, showing you guys things lots about the space. So if you guys are interested in the space and you want to learn more over time, I'll have daily content coming out. So I'd really recommend subscribing to this channel. Anyhow, let's get right into this video here. I'm going to go over to Trust Wallet to start off. And I'm just going to let everyone know once we're in our Trust Wallet here that I'm not going to show you guys how to create your Trust Wallet or how to buy or transfer BNB inside of this video here. Now, I will have separate tutorials linked in the description and in the comment section down below if you need to learn how to do either of those two things. So you just go ahead down there, learn how to do those things if you need to, and then you guys can come back to this video to learn how to buy the token. Another thing I want to point out as well is that you do have to have BNB inside of your Smart Chain wallet for it to show in PancakeSwap. So if you guys have your BNB inside of your BNB wallet right here, you just want to go ahead and click on your BNB wallet, click on Swap, then click on Swap to Smart Chain. You're going to want to send the appropriate amount that you want to swap into this Revolve Games token into your Smart Chain wallets, or else it will not let you access those tokens on PancakeSwap, and it won't let you swap the tokens, and it'll say zero balance. So you want to make sure that you have that and you're good to go there. Once you have that there and you're good to go, we can then head over to CoinMarketCap, which I'll have a link in the description and comment section for as well. So you guys just want to go over to the description and click on CoinMarketCap, and then I'll show you guys what to do once you're on CoinMarketCap. Once you're on CoinMarketCap here, we just want to go down to where we see contracts. All the way over to the right, you'll see two little squares. You want to go ahead and click on those squares to copy the contact address. Once you guys do that, we can then exit out of here, go back into our Trust Wallet. And then all we have to do is navigate to the top right of the screen where we see the two lines and two circles and click on that. Once we click on that, we can go to the top search here and paste that in as well. We'll then see no assets found, add custom token. So we can go ahead and click on add custom token. Then we just wanna change the network here from Ethereum over to Smart Chain and then paste the contract address in. Once we do that, everything else will load in for us automatically. So we can go ahead and click on save in the top right corner. And then we'll have a space for the token once we swap the BNB for it. So we can just back out of here and then now we can head over to the exchange. So I'll have a link over to PancakeSwap in the description and comment section. And of course, you guys just go ahead and Google it yourselves. But I'll show you guys what to do once you're on PancakeSwap. Once you guys are on PancakeSwap here, you just want to go to the top right corner of your screen where you see the connect wallet button. Click on that. And then we have an option to connect our wallets. We're actually going to use Wallet Connect here. Then it's going to pop up this screen asking us to choose our preferred wallet. Now, you guys can use any one of these wallets if you would like to, but I'm going to be showing you guys with Trust Wallet inside of this video. So I'm going to click on Trust Wallet here. It's then going to open up this connection screen inside of our Trust Wallet, asking us to connect PancakeSwap to our Trust Wallet. Reason being is so we can access our BNB and we can actually swap the token back to our Trust Wallet. So we're just going to click on Connect here and then back out of here and back into PancakeSwap. Now, once we're back in PancakeSwap, we'll know our wallet's connected when we see our wallet icon in the top right corner, as well as our balance of BNB right above BNB right here. Now, like I said before, if you guys do not see your balance of BNB right here, it's simply because the coins are not in your smart chain wallet. So you're going to make sure they are in your smart chain wallet. Then you guys can come back over here to PancakeSwap. Now, once we have that good to go, we can click on Select a Currency. I'm just going to paste our contract address that we got from CoinMarketCap right in here as well. We'll then see the Resolve, Revolve Games token. So we're going to click on Import. I understand and import. Once we have both tokens in here, we now have to change our slippage tolerance. So we're going to go beside where we see exchange all the way over to the right and we're going to click on the little sags gear. Now we can just go ahead and see where we see swaps and liquidity. I'm going to make sure our slippage tolerance is at least on 12% for this token. You guys can try higher or a little bit lower if you would like to, but if the transaction does fail, you're going to have to adjust the slippage tolerance. There is no 100% number to give you guys. It does change depending on the liquidity of the token at the time you're watching the video. So it might not be the exact same that you see me use in this video, but just leave a comment down below if you're having an issue and I'll be happy to try to help you guys out. So all you have to do now is exit out of here once you have at least 12% to try it out. And then we just have to decide how much BNB we want to transfer into this token. So let's just say, for example, I wanted to do one BNB. I can type in one BNB, and then it will show me the amount of the RPG token I'll get in exchange for that. Now, if you're happy with that and you're confident in your decision here, you can go ahead and click on where we see insufficient BNB balance. It'll say swap for you here. And then once you click on swap, it's going to show you a broken down version of your transaction, showing you your fees and things like that involved. Just make sure you understand that before you go ahead and click on swap one more time. Once you click on swap one more time, you should get a confirmation inside of your trust wallet asking you to connect or trade again. So once you receive that and you click on that, you will then have another second before you get this thumbs up on uh, pancake swap here. We're well, not a thumbs up, a uh, check mark at least, sorry. Uh, but once you guys have that there, you can then exit back out of here, right back into your trust wallet, and the token will arrive here usually within a couple minutes. 
Anyhow, I really hope I was able to help you guys out, showing you guys how to buy the Revolve Games token using Trust Wallet and PancakeSwap. If this video did help you out, be sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe for more content. Thanks for watching.